Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the Scorpion Sun Moon Horizon for the second week of September 2017. A week begin from the 11th until the 17th. It is the week of the heart. It is going to be a wonderful week, whatever the situation is that is around us. We are going to learn to deal with it in a positive way. Um, the energy of the heart, and it is also the week of the, the zodiac energy of the heart hurt also so it's good for you water sign people it's all about the harmony in the family it's all about harmony in the family the ten of waters for you scorpion so this is a very positive positive situation whatever the situation is it's the energy of harmony in the family okay so you're trying to bring back balance in your world whatever it is you're learning certain situation that is happening okay ladies and gentlemen there's a lot of messages with that will be coming in in this week there is judgment judgment call but it's going to be um a celebration there is going to be a call and it's going to be a call of celebration there's going to be a lot of regrets whatever is happening there's a lot of regrets you have the four of fire and the page of fire um, there is a situation with an organization and you have the ace of uh, hair I think so you have justice over an organization but we are going to look um, and see ten the ten of hair you have the ten of hair so there's a situation and the ten of air so let's go um, forward you have the page you have a lot of emotions you have the air sign a lot of water sign good balance only one air sign which is a ten of page let's see what's happening for the organization on Monday you have the princess of swords with the organization on Tuesday you have the king of cups um, <clears throat> on Wednesday you have the five of sword on Thursday you have the two of swords on Friday you have the prince of swords on Saturday you have the queen of pentacles and on Sunday the king of pentacles so <clears throat> we're looking at this and we're going to look and see what is going on there is a situation in organization and this organization has to do with this prince of swords whoever this prince of swords is you need to get the hell away from this woman i'm sorry to say that but you need to remove yourself away from this organization and this woman whoever this prince of sword princess of swords is this is somebody between the ages of 18 and 35 get away from this organization and this princess of swords you need not have to deal with these people remove yourself from this situation okay this is not good I am looking at this I'm feeling the energy that is coming off it is a sad sick organization I don't know how you got involved with this woman this person is someone who is a Aries a Gemini or a Libran release yourself move yourself away and I'm asking who is this woman in this organization this can be a partner I'm getting this can be a partner this is someone who works with black magic you need to release yourself from this situation she works with black magic because we have the magician and judgment um, so she works with a black magic whoever this person is she works with black magic you need to release yourself from this organization in this situation whenever the uh, energy of the magician comes up with a magic with the energy of judgment is someone who is working with black magic whoever this person is a, this is a Libra a Gemini or is a, a Aquarians remove yourself from these people whoever you are move move yourself from these people on Tuesday there is the energy of the ten of swords because you will try and move yourself away from this people and whatever is going to happen is that this king of cups is going to come in to help you this king of cups could be yourself that you are seeing um, the lies and situation that has happened and you're moving yourself away from it wherever the situation is 
for the people the older people you need to look at this situation very carefully because there is a situation that has happened that there's a lot of lies and stabbing in the back that is happening so be aware of this <clears throat> as we move on we have the page of fire the page of fire is a message that is coming in this message could be coming in from the Aries the Leo or the Sagittarius okay there's a message that is coming in um, this is a young person bringing a message to you this young person could be between the ages of 0 to 18 0 to 18 that is bringing a message to you and this message is from a child energy but it can also a message from someone who is an um, Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius be aware of this message whatever the message is coming in to say is that whatever hardship whatever that you were going through is coming to an end as we move forward we have the energy vibration of the four of ones and this is this energy of the four of ones is very good it's a very strong positive energy this is a situation that um, you're seeing happening around you um, you are now having a strong foundation whatever is happening you're building on a strong foundation and by building on this strong foundation you are going to see that your life is about to open up there's going to be a celebration if you're looking for a new house a new apartment new work you are going to be receiving that there is a clarity and a portal that is coming up especially for the people who are looking for a new apartment new house um, new situation new endeavor in your life you are going to see that um, this is going to be working out perfectly if you are looking for an apartment you're going to receive an apartment or a house whatever you're looking for it's going to be happening it's going to be opening up it's going to be coming up this is going to be powerful so this is going to be good on Friday <clears throat> we have a situation um, regrets and you're having regrets uh, over a situation with the king of swords okay whoever this person was whoever this king of sword is it is a Gemini a Libra or an Aquarius so maybe you had a business situation or you know this person and you're really 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 having um, a situation with this um, king of sword he has lost so much things he has broken down so much things and this is a situation that you're having with the king of swords so whatever it happening you're having a regret um, that you ever enter in a relationship or a partnership with this king of swords it's as if this king of swords took you to meet this uh, um, princess of swords and got you in this situation um, it's as if you who however you met this princess of swords you wouldn't have met her in the first place is that this king of swords you have regret meeting this king of swords and that is an Aquarius a Gemini over Libra on Saturday is a positive positive situation on Saturday um, because the Queen of Pentacles is here um, before Dalen um, the Queen of Pentacles is going to bring you good message it's going to bring you a before Dalen because um, whatever is happening um, on Sunday you have the three of ones a celebration so whatever is happening you have the three of ones a celebration with the King of Pentacles. So whatever is happening, there is a celebration that is coming up with the King of Pentacles. So as we look at the situation, and we're going to look, especially in the weekend, the weekend is a weekend of water. Okay. I hope that you're not in Florida and um, this is the hurricane, whatever. But whatever it is, you're connecting with your mother and father on the weekend. Whatever the situation is, it's as if if you or um, have your mother as a Taurus of Virgo or a Capricorn and your father also the Taurus of Virgo over a Capricorn there is a connection with you and these two people in the weekend okay one is going to be on Saturday your mother is going to be on Saturday your father is going to be on Sunday there is going to be a celebration with your father on Sunday okay 
whatever that has been happening in your life um, it, 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 the end of this week is going to bring in a wonderful new beginning to a positive place ahead and the Empress is watching over you and the Empress can be someone who is your grandma your grom grandmother your grandparents or your spirit guides who is watching over you because they're trying to help you to release you out of a situation that has been happening whatever is happening on Tuesday because you're trying to get rid of this princess of sword and this is someone who is an Aquarius a Gemini of a Libra you're trying to get rid of her and whatever that is happening on Tuesday there is going to be a stabbing of the back and this could be this person because she realized that she is not um, able to empower and power over people and uh, you're re realizing the lies that she has been telling the lies and and things that she has been telling and this week is a week of the page of fire so a whole lot of messages people will be bringing you a whole lot of messages about this queen um, this princess of sword that is someone between the ages of 18 and uh, um, 35 whatever the situation is uh, this woman is very destructive this woman works with um, black magic not white magic but black magic whoever this person is that is the only thing and form that she thinks she can manipulate people with and this is going to happen on Monday that you're going to realize what she has been doing this is why your week is going to be the 10 of water because you are going to be connecting with your parents your mother and father in um, the weekend so again for the people who parents if you have one or two parents who is a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn there is going to be a positive healing and celebration in the weekend because the energies are here um, the the Queen of um, the Queen of Pentacles is going to bring you information okay and you are going to have a celebration with a King of Pentacles if he's your father you're going to have a connection because this week is the week of the ten of waters I'm sorry my voice is going because I've been doing these readings so um, there's going to be a lot of clarity whatever hardship you were um, going through whatever situation that you were going through on Friday you are going to regret on Friday that you have met this Prince of Sword whoever this Prince of Swords is another um, Gemini um, this Prince of Swords is another Gemini Libra or Aquarians is someone you have met that um, have let you have the connection to this Prince princess of sword and that was a negative influence and negative energies okay the first half of the week is as if people stab you in the back and there's a lot of lies and that sort of a thing but you stand on your, you sit on your throne and um, you are going to release in this princess of swords whoever she is this Aquarian Gemini or Leah person you're going to be releasing them and uh, your mom is going to bring you positive news whatever that positive news is your mom is going to bring you it is a week where um, young people are going to be um, receiving a lot of messages or young people will be receiving a lot of messages but also people between the ages of 0 and 18 will be bringing older people um, messages to you um, the second half of the week is going to be a wonderful week of balance whatever the situation is if you're looking for a house a new place um, a new apartment a new house to buy or rent it is going to be available uh, clarity is there you're also going to have a healing with your father whatever is your father a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn there is going to be an healing with your father and there's also going to be um, a regret that you met someone uh, or you let someone in your life uh, and, um, and that is the energy of a prince of sorts so that is someone between the ages of 18 and 35 you are going to have regrets that you have let this person in your life I'm working with the angels of abundancy and let's see what the angels of abundancy have for the scorpion people in this 
look for a sign look for a sign this is positive whatever you were asking for they are saying look for a sign whatever the situation was that you were asking for they are saying to you look for a sign look for a sign whatever <clears throat> is happening just look for the sign because the universal angels are going to place the sign in your way look for the sign okay here we go how the message for the uh, angels of abundancy is going to be release yourself of jealousy release yourself of jealousy okay whatever is happening you you um need to release yourself of jealousy you, you really really need to release yourself of jealousy there's a situation that has been happening and you need to release yourself of jealousy so ladies and gentlemen i want to say to you thank you for being here thank you for these wonderful experiences that you have brought in my life as I have brought in your life this is going to be a positive week please remember to donate for the people who are in um, the restricted areas so as um, the people who have been going through this hurricane um, I want to say to each and every person um, right now um, I've been in Florida um, so um, if you um, don't receive any more um, weekly readings in the month of September then you are aware that we were uh, restricted by the hurricane so um, remember to pray um, for the people in Florida because for the people who can't leave their house their business whatever it is uh, pray for them and I'm asking each and every person out there please open up yourself and understand how very important these situations are and this situation is in your life and know that whatever we ask for um we always receive and whenever we ask for healing and releasing of these people we will be released okay um Please like and share these videos and if there's no um, weekly readings please listen to um, the um, general energies of September and your Sun Moon and rising sign for the month of September and I'm saying namaste until next time yeah.